Hi guys, how are you? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you a jewelry haul I've put together over the past week. Now, if you watched any of my previous videos, you probably noticed that I've been saying I need more jewelry, I need more jewelry, I need more jewelry in pretty much every single one of my videos. Certainly the ones where I talked about style and like what I'm wearing. I have a very, very small jewelry collection and I just felt like adding a few things that I can wear on a daily basis but I also wanted to keep it very affordable for myself because I'm just not in a place where I can buy very expensive things of jewelry. So this video is basically going to be me sharing what I got for myself and everything here is from Target and Amazon and everything I got is under $20. First I'm going to start with these earrings I got from Target. I think these are so so beautiful and I'm just going to go ahead and put these on. Actually no, you probably want to see them up close don't you? Okay. <laughs> so these are the earrings here and also I painted my nails and this is Expressy. It's Essie Express color um, that I actually so far really like. So anyway, these are the earrings. I honestly gravitate towards like such bright big earrings and jewelry, but I don't tend to wear that on a daily basis. So when I was in Target, I had to remind myself like get things you're actually going to wear on a daily basis. Don't like go for big like bright tassel earrings because that's just not it's not something I'm gonna reach for on you know the daily basis, but that's what I reach for when I'm shopping for things and <laughs> for jewelry. All right, let me move my hair back. So this is the earrings. I like them a lot. So these were my first, ooh, my first pick. I forgot I put the little stopper things on them. <laughs> I'm like, oh no, how are they stuck? Oh, it's just, it just broke. Hold on. All right, so we had a first um, breakage already. <laughs> so this thing already fell off, but I think it's kind of easy to fix because it just slides, slides on in there. Like it just kind of came off like that. Put those aside. Okay. All right, that's great. I also got this bracelet here. Now I, kind of need your opinion on this because I don't know if it's actually a good bracelet or if this is just something in my head. I don't know. What do you think? Do you like this type of a bracelet or not? It's got a cool clasp on the back. Um, so it's kind of easy to take it on and off. It's like magnetic little clasp. I don't know how I feel about this bracelet. I kind of love it, but I also don't know if I'll be wearing it a lot. My hunch says yes but I'm curious what you think of it. Another bracelet I got from Target is also $13 and this one I love. I've already worn it and I already know I'm in love and I'm gonna wear it a ton. Let me put it on and show you what it looks like. I just absolutely love this. You can obviously like order it however you want. You can just wear, you know, some and not all of them. I actually wore just the two small ones. This is definitely one of the best jewelry pieces from Target. So I would recommend this one based on my two times wearing it <laughs> already. But I will say like, I, I love this. I feel like this is just so wearable, easy to put on, comfortable, amazing. Another thing I got is a necklace. It was $15. And this is what it looks like. I love layerable necklaces. I used to wear necklaces. I used to like actually take separate necklaces and layer them in high school before that was a thing. And I remember I saw some other girls doing it right after I started doing it. So I was like, oh, it's kind of cool. I kind of started a trend. And I just always thought it looked really, really nice to layer a couple of necklaces. And of course now it's a very big thing. Now, I wasn't I wasn't the one that started the whole trend. I just think I influenced like maybe one or two girls, but I know that that is definitely something I like to do. So this is what the brace, I mean the bracelet, this is what the necklace looks like. I've already worn this as well and really, really like it. My only kind of like issue with this, um, I keep calling it bracelet, this necklace, is that sometimes the shorter chain and the longer chain, they don't exactly play well together. Like one would be over here, one would be over there. So you have to sort of like place it and keep keep an eye on it basically all right so i think that is everything i got from target let me just make sure i didn't forget something 
No, I think that's all I got from Target. Okay, so that's everything I got from Target. Now I have a stack of things I got from Amazon. I honestly don't know what is in each box because I don't know how everything's supposed to come packaged, but this is what I got from Amazon. And I guess I'm gonna start with this because it's the only pouch. <laughs> that I have, <laughs> it's my logic there. All right, so this is the one I'm not super sure about because I don't know if it's my style, but it's super trendy, it's very popular, so I figured I would get it and try it out and see what I think about it. It's this type of a necklace where you get the um, your initial on here and it's kind of like a little bit more masculine of a style, but it's very, very in right now, I guess. And, um, and the reason I got this also, not just because everyone else is doing it and I'm like, I'm gonna follow suit, but I also really like the idea of having a heavier looking necklace to have going into the fall season because I'm gonna be wearing sweaters, obviously. And I just think if you're wearing sweaters, it's good to have maybe heavier pieces because then you can wear it on top of the sweater theoretically <laughs> all right so i'm gonna go ahead and put this on this has my initial y for yana so oh it's kind of low <laughs> so i don't know how this is going to necessarily work for me i don't know if i love it right off the bat i kind of see the appeal of this just because i saw so many different ways people style this type of a necklace and i love the idea of putting this on top of maybe like a sweater or something like that but it's not like my style of jewelry, so I think I have to sit with it and decide for myself whether or not I want to go ahead and um, keep this. But I don't know what you think. Like, do you have this type of a necklace or this style of jewelry maybe uh, more so even? I'm curious because this is my first. <laughs> I need like one piece of trendy jewelry. Apparently it's very hard to open this one. <laughs> Hang tight. Uh, oh, yes. Okay. I have... A, hard time opening this, <laughs> but B, I have very, very high hopes for this. This is, I'm gonna show you once I open it because you can't even see what this is. <gasps> oh, it says they're handmade. I didn't even know that. I'm gonna try to show you them. I don't know how my camera is gonna focus because it's trying to focus on my face and I do feel bad because it's kind of, I'm probably confusing my camera at this point, but this is what they look like. Ooh having a hard time putting this in my ear. These are a little bit harder to put on because they're a little bit thicker and I think my ears are not used to wearing earrings so they're not like stretched out enough, but it's not a big deal. I'm sure they'll, they'll adjust, <laughs> I hope. But yeah, so let me move my hair back. This is what they look like. These ones don't at all look cheap. They look really expensive actually, I feel like. Let me show you the ring. I love it because it's very simple, but it's got this beautiful flower stamp on it. I think I got the wrong size for me. I think I'm actually number seven in size, not eight. So I really like this ring. It does have a more yellow, brighter color gold than what I would prefer. So I'm gonna put that aside. Okay, so next we have another thing. It's by the same company as the earrings I really liked. So fingers crossed, this is going to be a good one. <gasps> yes. Okay, color gold here is my kind of gold. <laughs> I already dropped one. All right, so this is what this looks like. I don't know if you'll be able to see. I'll just have to show you the one. So this one is really cool because the way you open it is like this. So it's kind of like sneaky. <laughs> um, but all right, so I'm gonna put this in my ear. All right, so this is what the earrings look like here. And I really, really, really like them. Again, they don't look cheap at all, but they were. And I think that Already from the two things I got from this company, Vacrona, I highly recommend looking into this specific one. And it says they were handmade, which is extra special. So I love these so, so much. I love the color gold. I love the price point. Now we're moving on to, I think I just have three more things to share with you. And the other three things I think are from the same company because the box looks exactly the same. <gasps> okay, color gold looks very promising here. Yes, yes. Actually, the whole thing looks very promising. So anyway, what I got is this turquoise and gold, very, very dainty bracelet. And I actually am planning on layering this with something else, um, but it's absolutely beautiful. 
I like how it's dainty, but it does have some color. So it's kind of like, again, that mixture of elegant and very like jewelry ish -y. That doesn't make any sense. But like, you know what I mean? Like that very kind of elegant and dainty, but also with like a little spark of fun in there. I love this. I love this. The main thing is the gold color has to be right. I don't know if it's just in my head or what, but I feel like real gold to me has a very specific color it's not too yellow that's the main thing is it's not too too yellow and i feel like fake gold if it's not done right it has a very bright yellow color and again i could be wrong there could actually be very expensive real gold that has a very yellow color but to me it's just like it looks cheap so this one has the right color gold i'm obsessed already i might just leave it on did I get any necklaces? I feel like I got a necklace in here somewhere. My plan was to like just keep the jewelry on as I'm trying it so I, I kind of look not so bare um, through the video. I also realized that my hair was covering my shirt just now. I am wearing a shirt. <laughs> I swear. <laughs> All right, so the same brand and this one is a necklace. This one is evil eye layered necklace all right so this is what that looks like i really really like it i think this is a very pretty very dainty piece and again this specific necklace came in a bunch of different variations so you don't just have to get this specific style there's actually a butterfly one that i really want that was very very pretty definitely a very very good option if you're looking for affordable necklaces this specific one seems good i again don't know how anything is actually going to hold up and the last thing i'm gonna get i don't know why i just took the necklace off i should have just kept it on so i had it for the rest of the video but i'm my mind is just like put it on take it off put it on take it off <laughs> okay anyway and the last thing i'm gonna mention for this video is this bracelet okay so bracelet looks good i'm really happy with it the color looks good my camera's having a very hard time like focusing between my face and <laughs> and the bracelets it's a process okay so i have to definitely get rid of the excess chains um because i feel like they're just gonna weigh the bracelet down i just like the fact that they are different but the fact that they have turquoise in both of them kind of unites them and makes them look like a pair all right so i think i'm actually going to go ahead and put back the necklace because i don't want to end the video of my jewelry haul with no jewelry on <laughs> it would be kind of strange <laughs> i mean it wouldn't be but like i should have probably kept something on now i feel like i can end the video but anyway i hope you guys have enjoyed this one if you did make sure to give this one a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more future videos but on that note i hope you have a wonderful rest of your day i hope to see you in the next video and i'm gonna go ahead and sign off and see you in the next one <laughs> bye